Hello YouTube! It is day tres of our advent calendar build with me Lego thing. And that means we're opening day number three on the advent calendar for you who are playing along at home. Day three is over here, so let's open this up. This is a little car from the looks of the instruction manual. So, gonna print this for you ASMR people at home. our Lego bits. I'll put that over there. And okie doke. This looks pretty straightforward. So we're going to connect the wheels here to the little wheel connector part. I guess the uh, axle or fulcrum or however you want to word it. They're kind of cool little wheels. They've got like a spoke on them. I don't know if you can see that there or not. Hmm. Oh well, if you can't, I'm sure you can see these online. We'll see if we can post a close up on our Instagram. But uh, they actually have space on them for tires as well, but it doesn't come with tires. You could always like dig through your parts bin and get the right size tires, or I think there's uh, online Lego stores where you can buy the parts individually, unofficially from Lego. Okay, so we've got the four wheels set up, then it goes, we put the 4x2 plate and connect these together as such. Remember when you were little and this was the best you could do for a car? No fancy stuff, just wheels and a plate or a brick. Elon Musk, does this look familiar to you? It's not quite Cybertruck. All right, uh, this goes as such. So we take the little uh, hood piece. So this is like a little race car, like a F1 or something like that. Uh, there's a spoiler. Spoiler alert. Hmm? Oh, it's literally right there. <laughs> oh, jeez. I'm like blind. Um, what orientation is that? Okay, it's this way. So, and you clip the little uh, spoiler on the back there with the two little clippy bits. You go put this guy on there. And that's the hood of the car. That goes on there, and this goes there. Or you could omit the steering wheel altogether and make it Lego person sized, which we might do with a future one with the bendable legs. So, extreme donuts. Woo! <laughs> got the maturity of a, uh, a brick. So, <laughs> hey, he fits. I mean, he kind of holds the steering wheel at the right size. I guess it's like a stand-up go-kart. I hope you enjoyed this build. I know I actually enjoyed it. Uh, I know it was, yesterday was a little lackluster, but it's fun to kind of put different bricks together. Um, let us know if you guys have any traditions that you'd like to celebrate with your family if you do advent calendars. Um, Val and I were actually talking about how like growing up we only really did advent calendars that came from our aunt and uncle and they were like Catholic ones because we were raised Roman Catholic so it was all like 
a star forms in the east over Bethlehem and like Bible quotes and Proverbs and stuff like that. Uh, and then the my introduction to advent calendars outside of that was I went to my friend Dalton who has been referenced in a previous video with the, uh, the hot sauce. Went to his birthday which is like late November and his mom, I guess for party favors, got everybody advent calendars and I had a Shrek advent calendar that had chocolate in it. And I was like, holy cow, you can get advent calendars with things in them. And that was like, switch clicked in my head and I was thinking about like all the different types of ad advent calendars you could do. And then I saw in my Lego magazine that they had a Lego advent calendar. And that was where this obsession with this advent calendar started. So, the lifelong quest has finally reached fruition, and hopefully this becomes a tradition. I'm not intending to rhyme there. <laughs> yeah, let us know if you have any holiday traditions that you like to do with your family. Uh, real tree, fake tree, what's your side on that debate? Uh, Christmas or happy holidays, what do you think? Let us know down in the comments below. Uh, if you're not subscribed, make sure you are for new videos that we are going to be uploading every day for the 24 days of Advent, as well as our regular scheduled content on Mondays and Thursdays. Make sure you ring the bell so you don't miss any of those updates. Ring that bell. And uh, yeah, like the video if you liked it. If you didn't like it, leave us a comment and let us know what we can do to make things better for you. Uh, again, thanks for watching. I hope you have a great day and a happy holiday or Merry Christmas or Happy Hanukkah or Joyous Kwanzaa or whatever else you want to celebrate this time of Yuletide, I guess, is the other one <laughs> that I could think of. So have a great day and thanks for watching.